Hey guys, I got a new video for you today and we're going to be taking a look at a new pair of knock-around sunglasses that I just received. Now when I saw that these launched, um, I quickly fell in love with the color combination black and red. It has always been a combination of colors that I really do enjoy. But it wasn't until I actually received them today in the mail, opened them up, took a look at them, that I saw how much detail went into this particular pair and it is safe to say that it immediately became one of my favorite pairs from Knockaround. And if you guys follow, if you guys follow the channel, you know that um, I've been picking up quite a bit of different models from them, especially in their custom releases and limited editions and things like that. So this is actually one of those. As you guys can see from the card here, this is called Nevermore. And uh, this is a um, limited run of a thousand. So this was number 835 out of a thousand. And Nevermore um, obviously comes from the Edgar Allan Poe um, poem. And here is a little excerpt that they put in the back here. It says, there is no beauty without some strangeness. And then it's got his signature down there. I thought it was really cool that they included that in the back of the card here. Usually when um, you get these cards from the um, the, the limited run of um, styles from Knockaround, it's usually just a, a white card that has the name and then the, the number. But I like the fact that they added that in the back. It makes it look really cool, especially if you're going to be displaying them. So it comes in this box that they've been kind of doing lately for their limited edition. Again, this is a limited edition. It says that there. And it's got a, a little bit of information on the side. So this is the Fort Knox model. This is actually my favorite model from Knock Round because it does have spring hinges. So it fits my face a little bit better. And again, it's called the Nevermore. I just wish that they would include a little bit more information as far as like either frame color or lens color or anything like that. But this does say that it is polarized because these lenses are polarized. So let's go ahead and open it up. Now, um, I'll leave a link below to uh, some of the other videos that I've done from Knockaround if you guys want to see some of the uh, stuff that they've put out in the past. And then also a link to their site. Unfortunately, this model sold out very, very quickly. Um, it's actually already sold out. But I know once in a while you can find some of their models on the secondary market. So if you guys are interested in this model, definitely I would recommend looking it up on the secondary market. So um, one of the things that I love about Knockaround is that they go all out, especially with their limited editions. And um, you know that's to say that they not only go all out on the frame, but also on the microfiber bag and some of the other accessories like the card here. So again, this is the Nevermore, um, uh, you know, related to Edgar Allan Poe. So you have Edgar Allan Poe's picture right here on the microfiber bag and then his signature at the bottom there. Really, really awesome. And I like the fact that they went with this black and white look to the bag because it kind of adds to the look of the glasses themselves. So speaking of the glasses, again, this is the Fort Knox model and here they are. I'm not sure if you're able to um, appreciate just all the subtle differences that they've done in this frame. They put a lot, a lot of different things into this frame, which is really, really awesome. Just from looking at the picture, I, I really didn't realize how much they did, but um, I'll give you um, a little bit of an example as we go through the frame itself. So on the front here, on the front portion of the frame, it's actually called an inky black to clear crimson fade. So basically it's like a polished black on the top here and then it fades to a red or crimson down here, which is really nice. And then that kind of travels right here where the hinges are, which is really, really cool. And then on the sides, on the stems right here, you have um, basically, it, it's called a flurry of feathers down each arm. So obviously, um, Edgar Allan Poe, uh, the Raven, so they had to kind of include that and the camera's kind of going in and out, but they have to include that on the side right there. So you have these um, raven feathers on both sides there. So it's really cool. And then the knock around um, logo right here and the little lug on the side there, um, it's uh, midnight. So they're, um, it's almost like a, uh, like a dark gray coloring, gunmetal color. So that's really cool. And then the lenses are polarized and they're blood red lenses. So uh, maybe by turning like this, you guys can see. So they have um, some red and then depending on how the light hits it, a little bit of yellow hue to it. And then on the side right here on the top, you have a anatomical heart etched into the, um, into the lens. And that's obviously a callback to the Nevermore 
Um, if you guys have ever, you know, read the poem or heard it or anything like that, you know that um, you hear a heartbeat and stuff like that. So I'm trying to get a little bit more light because what really surprised me was obviously, you know, you have the transition from the front right here to the stems or the arms on the side, and you have this kind of clear crimson red portion right there, which is really cool, it kind of uh, breaks it up. But then um, you have the feathers on the outside, but on the inside, and let me see if the camera will catch this. Maybe I need a little bit more light. I'm gonna bring this light a little bit closer. Oh, here we go. Let's see if, let's see if the camera will catch this. Um, see, there's a skull right there. Can you guys make it out there? So on the inside portion of the arm, there's a skull on that side. And then on this side, it actually reads, nevermore. But there is words, maybe you can read it right here. You have some wording, and then you have um, a clock on this side. And there it is. See the clock right there? So that is really, really cool. That's a really cool added touch that um, it's on the inside, so you're not able to see it from the outside, but you know that it's there. And that's why I was saying that they added a lot of really cool little hidden details. Let's see if we can make up the skull a little bit better here. There it is, and then words all around it. So really, really awesome. I think Macaron did a great, great job with this pair. Um, I'm really glad that I picked it up. Now, I signed up to be alerted via text and email whenever they come out with new models and new styles and stuff like that. And if you guys are interested in you know starting maybe to pick up some of their models, I would definitely recommend that you sign up to, uh, to get those alerts via email or via text message because, again, this model sold out very, very quickly. Obviously, because of the look, you know, you have a really awesome, you know, uh, pair of sunglasses, the microfiber bag that goes along with it. You have the card right here. It's limited to a thousand pieces, but um, probably the best price, the best thing is the price. These are full polarized lenses and they're $35 and I believe it was $5 shipping. So $40 um, with the shipping. Uh, it came in about three days, you know, to me. So great, great um, turnaround as far as the shipping goes. And um, it's an awesome pair. You know, it looks really cool displayed. Um, if you want to display it like on a, on a shelf or something like that with the bag. And then you can actually see all the stylings from the feathers and stuff like that. I think it's it, it looks really nice. And I've always mentioned this in my videos. I think for display purposes, Knockaround is probably one of the best um, brands out there for that because they go all out with everything even sometimes including the box that it comes in um, But also just just to wear them and, and whatnot, you know, you can you could definitely wear them You know everyday style and stuff like that. So there it is I just kind of wanted to show you guys that if you're interested definitely check out some more of, of my videos on some of the other styles of knock around Maybe you'll see one that you like and maybe you'll start your own collection. So there it is. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks